Hi Cancer, welcome to your love reading. How are you? I hope everything is fine with you. In this general love reading, I will be talking about your love story using tarot. I will be looking at the current energies, the energies in the near future, the person on your mind, if you have somebody new, the possible outcomes and other details as well. First, let's shuffle four times the deck. If you are new here, don't forget to subscribe because I post videos every day. And if this reading resonates with you, I will do an extended as well. Uh, at the end of this video, where I will talk more about the person that is on your mind right now. Let's start with what are the energies around you? Things are moving slowly. There is a situation that seems very imbalanced, not fair, one-sided, and with slow progress towards commitment. It feels like something has been closed. Something is over. A door has been closed. What is affecting you in your subconscious? This person acting very mean, very rushed towards them ending the connection, maybe not thinking it twice, and maybe a manipulator with their words. The communication of this person was not that good. What about the challenges or the main challenge of the past? I think that you started to trust this person too early, without getting much data or uh, you needed more time to to create an idea about this person or you were too naive to trust them uh, i see some uh, immaturity uh, in this connection as well from one of the partners and some yes there, there was this desire to move this forward but trusting too early or trusting too much that might have been one of the main problems now your focus is very clear ten of pentacles you want to build a long lasting uh, legacy family uh, you want a long-term commitment something that is with a solid foundation and you fear that the connection with this person that is on your mind is not there anymore that there is a big disconnection there that you cannot be anymore in a relationship with each other that is your fear but let's see about this person that is on your mind what are their energies and what are their thoughts towards you right now at the bottom of the deck i have the white heart or the full card This person seems like uh, they might want to send a message to you, make a proposal or reach out to you, but they don't see you interested anymore. They think this is over, this ended, and you are upset and you will not or will never change your attitude or opinion about them. It's quite interesting that this person has been thinking and reflecting a lot. They see this emotional distance that, that is between you and them. But after all this reflection, they want to give this another chance. In fact, they want to start a new chapter and they want to build a long-term heavy commitment. Do they have motivation? Yes, they have that desire inside themselves, but they don't uh, uh, think or... They don't believe this can happen or this can be manifested. They are very sad. They feel disappointed. It seems like they are thinking that they should have acted differently, that they shouldn't have made some mistakes or rushed something. They want a new beginning, a new chapter there. Let's see what uh, signs do I have here. I have uh, fixed signs, Aquarius, Taurus, Leo, and Scorpio. Uh, Aquarius is emphasized. I have Virgo as well. Scorpio is here emphasized as well. And Aries. 
So they might have had uh, their sun sign in one of those signs or the moon or the rising sign. Now, if you want to know more details about this person, the extended video uh, will give even more details about the energies of this person and the energies between you and them and other details. Now, let's continue with a possible outcome right now for this timeline timeline for you and this person that is on your mind. It's quite interesting. I see a restart of this. I'm not quite sure if... Uh, it seems promising, in fact. It might seem quite much better. I think you will be in a connection with each other again. There will be a new beginning motivated by the desire that seems very strong from both of you. And you moving in together or celebrating the love. There's a new chance being given here. And look, I have good cards here. Six of Pentacles, the Judgment. So this seems much more harmonious this time and much more stable. So if you have been hoping for a restart of that connection with this person from the past, I think there's a high chance, uh, if this reading is, re is resonating with you, that you will have a new beginning with them and it will be much, much better than the last time. Okay, let's continue with uh, if you have somebody new if you or if you are looking for someone new. Be careful of any manipulators. Be careful, Cancer. I'm not getting... Uh, you might connect with somebody, but they might give you some confusion or it might not be that long term. Uh, you might have your intuition telling you, screaming at you that this is not right. You cannot trust them. And yes, trust your gut feeling in this case, because I don't think they are very honest with you. If you are confused, if you think they are cold and detached, yes, the feelings they have are not that strong. So do I have something new as a connection in the near future you might connect with somebody but just be aware not to tolerate any uh, of them crossing your healthy boundaries protect yourself from some uh, manipulators that might be around here so it's very important to connect with the right person uh, during this time and about the past person i see much more positive uh, energies here okay this was the general reading more details in the extended video in the description box below if this resonated with you please hit the like button it helps a lot the channel share the video don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already because i post videos every day i wish you all the best and i will see you the next reading bye for now